In this narrative, Frank suffered a heart attack while alone at home with his five-year-old daughter, Savannah. She became the crucial lifeline for her father during this critical moment. As Frank began experiencing the symptoms of a heart attack, he acted swiftly despite the pain gripping his chest. Realizing the urgency, he managed to grab his phone and dialed 911 before losing consciousness. Fortunately, the call connected just before he passed out. At that time, Savannah was the only other person in the house. With her father incapacitated, the responsibility of ensuring his safety fell upon her tiny shoulders. It was a daunting task for a young child, but Savannah rose to the occasion without hesitation. Frank's heart attack was triggered by an allergic reaction, which left him unable to move or communicate. In a cruel twist of fate, the man who was supposed to care for his daughter now relied on her for assistance. Despite the gravity of the situation, Savannah remained steadfast by her father's side, fully aware of the critical role she played in saving his life. For both Frank and Savannah, this experience was undoubtedly overwhelming. Frank faced the stark realization that his young daughter was his sole caregiver in a moment of crisis. Meanwhile, Savannah, at just five years old, confronted the immense pressure and fear of witnessing her father in distress and needing her help urgently. Ultimately, Savannah's bravery and quick thinking were pivotal in ensuring her father received the necessary medical attention, showcasing extraordinary courage beyond her years. As Frank and his young daughter enjoyed their time together at home, he suddenly felt a sharp pain in his chest. The pain intensified, making it difficult for him to breathe. Gradually, Frank lost his ability to speak and began to feel drowsy. Thankfully, he managed to dial 911 for help just before losing consciousness, though the phone slipped from his hand as he fell. Seeing her father unconscious, Savannah understood that she needed to take action. With quick thinking, she picked up the phone and spoke to the dispatcher. It was crucial because her dad had collapsed, and she knew she had to call someone for help. The dispatcher answered promptly and asked for details of what had occurred. Despite the urgency of the situation, Savannah remained calm. She assured the dispatcher that her semi-conscious father would be all right and provided as much information as she could about the incident. When asked, Savannah confidently told the dispatcher her age and name, showing maturity beyond her years. Recognizing the severity of the situation, the dispatcher swiftly dispatched police officers and an ambulance. Throughout the call, he was impressed by Savannah's poise and composure. Despite the stress of the moment, she spoke clearly and calmly, conveying the urgency of her father's condition without panic. In that critical moment, Savannah's courage and quick action played a crucial role in ensuring her father received the necessary medical assistance demonstrating remarkable bravery and maturity for a child her age. And then the dispatcher began guiding Savannah through the necessary steps. Since she was Frank's only hope of getting help, he asked if their front door was locked. Uncertain, Savannah tried asking her dad, who unfortunately couldn't respond. Realizing she needed to act, Savannah checked the door herself. Finding it locked, she followed the dispatcher's instructions and opened it for the arriving officers. However, she then remembered something important. Savannah realized the officers would soon be there and she was still in her tank top. She informed the dispatcher and mentioned she needed to get dressed quickly. The dispatcher reassured her that what she was wearing didn't matter to the officers, even if it was just pajamas. Despite the gravity of the situation, Savannah remained composed. She stayed on the phone with the dispatcher, following his instructions diligently. Comforting her father, she assured him everything would be okay and that she was right there with him. Juggling her responsibilities, Savannah continued updating the dispatcher while ensuring her father remained conscious and breathing. Her calm demeanor impressed the dispatcher, who was initially concerned about how a young child would handle such a critical situation. As they worked together, Savannah impressed the dispatcher with her maturity and ability to handle the situation calmly. Though there were concerns about how she would cope emotionally, Savannah remained focused and resilient throughout the ordeal. While the dispatcher worried about Savannah's well-being and how she would handle the stress, Savannah herself had something lighter on her mind. 
She humorously mentioned her concern about being in pajamas to the dispatcher, showing a touch of innocence amidst the seriousness of the situation. She felt very stressed about being in her pajamas and not wearing presentable clothes. Savannah didn't want anyone to see her like that when they arrived home. Despite this concern, the dispatcher had to convince her to stay with her father and not leave him alone. As they continued talking, the dispatcher asked Savannah to open the door for the officers who were approaching. But Savannah had something else on her mind. She wanted to introduce her dog to the dispatcher. Even in the midst of such a serious situation, Savannah found a moment to proudly introduce her beloved dog, Lulu, to the dispatcher over the phone. She was delighted to talk about her pet, showing her affection and pride as a young owner. Earlier, the dispatcher had worried that Savannah might panic under the pressure of the situation with her father. However, seeing how calmly she handled everything reassured him. He even joined in her conversation about her dog to keep her engaged and calm. The dispatcher asked if Lulu was friendly, and Savannah happily responded, describing her dog's behavior. This light-hearted conversation provided a brief moment of relief in the tense situation. Despite the off-topic conversation about her dog, the dispatcher recognized Savannah's capability to handle the emergency until the officers arrived. He knew she was the only one home and had to take charge while waiting for help to arrive for her father. Finally, after what felt like a long phone call to the dispatcher, the officers and an ambulance arrived at their home. It was a relief for Savannah, knowing help was there for her father, who was still unable to speak or breathe properly. Until then, Savannah remained remarkably calm and composed. There were no signs of her panicking or becoming overwhelmed, possibly because the home was quiet and peaceful. However, her demeanor changed when she heard the ambulance and officers arriving. The dispatcher reassured her that everything would be all right, comforting both her and her father. The most challenging part was over. Once the officers arrived, they quickly assessed Frank's condition. They determined that he wasn't having a heart attack, but did require hospitalization. Fortunately, his situation wasn't as dire as initially feared. Had Savannah panicked and made the situation more chaotic, the outcome could have been much worse. As it turned out, Frank suffered from a complex medical condition prone to severe allergic reactions, although this was his first experience with such a serious episode. Savannah was aware of her father's condition and the dispatcher also became informed during their conversation. The incident could have been life-threatening if not handled properly. Savannah's calm and brave actions ensured that her father's life was not in danger. Her cooperation with the emergency responders was crucial in averting a potential tragedy. The public was moved by the conversation, which took place under such intense circumstances, making it both poignant and inspiring. Following his medical treatment, Frank recovered fully. He expressed his immense gratitude to Savannah, embracing her and praising her bravery. He assured her of how proud he was and promised her a well-deserved reward. From Savannah's experience, there's a valuable lesson for everyone. Remaining calm in crisis is essential. Panic rarely helps resolve issues and can often make them worse. Savannah's composed reaction in a critical situation serves as a powerful example of how maintaining composure can lead to clear thinking and effective action.